Go to add point and draw a line. Go to create shape tool and create a shape. Add another point in the middle. Click on the line to select all the points. Press Ctrl C and Ctrl V to duplicate. Duplicate again and flip it over. Do it again for the leg and make it a bit longer. Last time duplicate for the leg and flip it over. Go to select shape tool and select the torso. Increase the width. Go to draw shape tool. Select the black color and draw the head. Select the body layer, make a groove and convert to bone. Select the body layer again, right click, quick setting, turn on path, apply. Now you can see the points where to add the bones. Select the chest bone before adding arm bones to allow the arm bones parents to the chest bone. Do it the same for the lower part. The bone structure and the bone parents should be like this. Select the body layer. Select a bone on the leg. Go to bind points. Select a point on the Click leg. Bind points. Select a bone on the upper leg. Select another two points on the leg and bind points. If you're not sure, please look at the map. Keep doing the same process for the other body parts. Click the head area to select all the points and hit bind points. Now go to frame one and play around. Your character is ready. If you still want to improve your rigging, add one more bone on the leg. Name it right leg target. Add one more bone on another leg, name it left leg target. Remove parents from both target bones. And then reduce all the strengths. Select lower legs and link them to target bones one by one. Now your rigging has improved, which is invert kinematic techniques. Oh, <laughs> yeah.